name is Susan Yee. You might say that I live in the heart of Montreal. I am a Chinese Canadian. My parents were born in China, but I was born here in Canada. It takes me about 10 minutes to walk to school, but in the summertime, it takes me about five. Bonjour, les enfants. Bonjour, Madame Bernard. Comment allez-vous? Très bien, merci. Et vous? Je vais très bien, merci. Quel jour est-ce aujourd'hui? C'est mercredi le 5 mars 1975. Quel temps fait-il aujourd'hui? Regardez dehors. Madame Bernard is my French teacher. She comes from Haiti. She was my French teacher since grade one when I started to learn French. Quel jour vient avant dimanche? Avant dimanche vient samedi. Quel jour vient? In my class, there are kids from Portugal, Greece, and some were born here. Avant vendredi vient jeudi. Quel jour vient avant dimanche? Avant dimanche vient samedi. Accent. Accent. Grave. 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 Accent. Accent. Grave. Grave. Continue. Madame Vernat tries to make the class more interesting by playing games. It doesn't work. Vous avez Monsieur Vincent, Mademoiselle Suzanne, Monsieur Michel, Mademoiselle Felicitas, Monsieur Selby, Mademoiselle Choukvan, Monsieur Kiri et Monsieur Edouard. On commence. Un, deux, trois. La tête, les épaules, les genoux, les pieds. La tête, les épaules, les genoux, les pieds. La tête, les épaules, les genoux, les pieds. Ah, comme je suis content. Deux. Les yeux. We only have gym once a week, but I wish we had it every day. <laughs> Doing backflips is a great way to lose weight. Ready? Okay, jump. Okay, Michael, try to line out my head. I don't know. Okay. When you do a backflip, you bend your elbows, then swing it, then you start jumping up, and you <laughs> land on your feet, then you land on any place else. Nice. <laughs> Your time. That's Arnold. He's my enemy. We've been enemies for two years. Arnold thinks he's Tarzan. After school, when I come home, I help my grandmother and my mother and my father make jewelry boxes. We usually make about 200 boxes a day. Last summer, we made boxes for the Olympic coins. My grandmother came here around 23 years ago. She and my grandfather bought the house that we now live in. 
Sometimes my grandma likes to talk about the olden days when there were houses with gardens and trees. I can remember when there were trees and gardens a few years ago. There used to be a lot of people on the street, and I used to know most of them. In 1972, all the houses around here were abandoned. All the people had to move out. My cousins and I used to shine our flashlight in the windows. My father used to own a laundry, but his customers had to move away when they tore the houses down. Now he works as a cook in a Chinese restaurant. On his day off, my father helps make jewelry boxes. They dynamite blast about four times a day. Noise hears my brother. You can do it long. Yeah. Told you. Okay, bring it. We're afraid our house might be torn down too. My father doesn't want to sell the house and he hopes he won't have to. Sundays, I go shopping with my mother and baby brother in Chinatown. That's my brother with the pink snowsuit. It used to be mine when I was a little girl, but to hand me down. Father thinks they might demolish Chinatown and put up modern buildings here too. <laughs> My mother thinks that Chinatown has the best part. You could get many things here that other regular stores don't have. Living where I am has one big advantage. I live right next to the mountain. There are a lot of things that you could do in Mount Royal. You could skate, you could go for a sleigh ride, you could ski and break your leg, and you could go tobogganing. Thank <laughs> you. 
The weekends were longer, then I could spend more time on the mountain.